Hey guys! I just purchased and just finished downloading Tales from the Borderlands. Everyone has been asking me for a while that I should play this. Um, especially on my Twitter. I have been being, I have been blown up so many times saying that you need to play this game. So, I finally gave in. I do love Borderlands. I have played Borderlands 2 and I am now playing the pre-sequel on my Xbox 360. Super excited, just got it a few days ago. So, I'm going to start this game, and I really hope it's as good as the others. I have not had the chance to play one yet. That is the next one I'm going to buy. Probably be for the Xbox 360. I'm gonna be all over this. Oh my goodness. Okay, well that'll make it so much easier. I've never really had the chance to use WASD yet in the game. I'm going to try. Don't get mad. I'm more of a 360 girl. in this. Oh, my. oh, I'm so excited. You have no idea. Like Back I again know. to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were oh, told to contain guess. mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporty. I love Jack. He's one of my favorite characters. He ran the corporation Hyperion and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less, ah, uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Some sort of radiation leak, I don't know. About. <laughs> oh, that's me. I thought it's gonna be like the other borderlands where I can take my character. Mm. So, 
Who are, are you? Eyes. I ask the questions. <clears throat> okay, then. Do you mind asking yourself who you are? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas project. <laughs> is that what this is about? <laughs> Look, Gordas is back. Real hot investment. I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Don't be a smartass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're. Getting dragged through the desert and uh <laughs> from the beginning. Right. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I Suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack, he was the you baddest guy of them all. This long. It must feel good I to find to be rabbit, just you know? like him. Take it. It's yours, right? <laughs> I mean, you always said that. <laughs> Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but, uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. <laughs> oh, <my goodness. laughs> Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. <laughs> but a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. For the better. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're gonna buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. Being an exec in Hyperion comes with expectations. Yeah, there are a couple sweet rides I've been looking at. More fitting of the position I'm gonna be in. Where the hell would you even drive that thing? We're in space. I wouldn't actually use it. It would be more for looks. Oh, right. Well, then that's a great idea. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because <laughs> you made it. You deserve this, man. Hmm. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Hey, hey. We made it, okay? We're in this together. If I'm moving up, we're all moving up. You can be certain of that. I appreciate that, Reese. You know, people around here have short memories when it comes to that stuff. You, me, Yvette, we're gonna run this place. Yes, we are. I wonder if Yvette was that chick that was on the main screen. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. Hmm. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. <laughs> Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. I love this no, guy. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why. Okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. Nice car. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So, you might not have been in the loop. Well, congratulations on your promotion. I love what you've done with the office. Going for the whole minimalist thing. Oh, that's cute. 
You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. Because <laughs> I thought this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same dick. reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl. And why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. <laughs> it's destiny, Reese. And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you could hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul. Your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. That's a body. You don't want to be that man. Wow. I could Take not have timed that better. That really helps office? dramatically make my point. Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million, yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Three years sucking up to the guy. Uh, Out the window. Oh, that should be yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, no, but... Only less... vasquez -y. Do you want the money or not? Cause I... Ugh. Why do the biggest scumbags always have the best view? It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get... Yes. Okay. Oh, is I... Wait, okay, Q to activate Yeah, that's what we had before. I just got this promotion. No, no. What a waste. Such a nice suit. Yeah, uh, look, look, look. Are you <laughs> going? Yeah, Why are you turning this into a whole thing right now? All the look like just that. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's gonna be ten million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay. Say out of your mouth. Damn it. Ah. Now, uh, what were we talking about? Before we were so rudely interrupted. We were talking... <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion. All right, your uh, promotion. Henderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one. Humility. But you... I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm gonna make you assistant vice janitor. What? No, no, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. 
Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. Douche. You can't humiliate me. I quit. Careful now, kid. The only way you quit Hyperion is the way Henderson did. You're dismissed, Reese. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No. No, no, this can't be happening. I'm finished, Bob. I'm finished. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, 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 they can't. Not yet. Unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta keep it on the down low until we figure something out. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 <laughs> for trash cleanup. Because that is your job now. To clean up trash <laughs> with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something. I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? Hmm. I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. It's my job now, Yvette. No. Well, okay, yes, technically, but not for long. It's that prick Vasquez. He threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So does that mean you're not buying? Okay. Well, just trying to lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type we to... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. We steal his deal. We steal his deal. But how are we gonna get yes! the money? That is what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is its vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Askez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. Wait, what? I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right? Hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. Well, things get dicey. Look. It's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends. Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now and when you get back. <laughs> <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? Y you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just, <laughs> you're gonna steal something. <laughs> no. No, don't worry. Got a car in mind. Is that a clap trap unit? Oh, no, wait. Hey, this is after Jackson, so there's only one clap trap unit. Oh. 
All right. Hello. Could have just asked nicely. I'd really like to know how he got a hold of that car. And in the picture on the computer, he was looking for black and red. But I guess yellow does go with that area. He looks in fighting anyway. You're so scared! And poor baby. Holy freaking crap, what was that? What? What do we even oh, what do we why? even hit? Why? Oh, I hope that wasn't why like a really ugly person. What would you cross right there? Oh crap. I think we I think we killed it. Poor Are we baby. murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great, we murder. You know, I, I thought it would take longer than 20 seconds before that happened. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. <laughs> they breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. It is. Kind of. No. Oh, it's still alive. Not for long with that bird coming down. So, what do we say if someone asks where we got the money? I can never remember what, what they're mean? called. Well, I mean, what do we tell people? We should have a story. I, mean, I would prefer not to tell them that we stole it from Hyperion. That would not go over well. I just think we need a plan of some sort. Let's just say Vasquez gave it to us to make the deal. Do it that way. Yeah. Uh, I guess I wanted a cooler plan, but I suppose that'll work. <laughs> so, this looks not good. We got ourselves a new here. What are you looking at? All right, hate Pandora. Pandora. With that other what did you expect? Yeah, no, I know. I, I guess I'm just now more acutely aware that I have ten million dollars chained to me, is all. In a neighborhood, I might add, of back planet nut jobs. I'm just getting a vibe, you know? Just keep your eyes open for the place, okay? I don't want to be here any longer than we have to. Yeah. And uh, watch the money. Oh, really? <laughs> Listen, one tap on the arm, and Yvette can send down a loader bot if things get too entertaining. That's true. And she gave me this. It is a stun baton. I do not know how it works, but it's definitely... <laughs> yeah, stick. Neato. God, I can't wait to be in that chair. You, and me, a vet. I mean, we bring this key back, and they're gonna make us the once and future kings of that place for sure. They'll send in a crew to use the key, and then that's it. Then it's kick back on the moon beach time. Don't think so small, my friend. We're not just gonna run Hyperion. We're gonna be responsible for plundering a vault. And you can count on two fingers the number of people who have even gotten close to that. Yeah. <laughs> Sound like something you would say. The tracker's beep beep beeping, but I don't see the place. It's the world of curiosities, right? Yeah, do you see it? Close. No. Could ask one of them. They seem normal-ish. Normal-ish enough. Anyway. What an excellent idea. I thought so myself. <laughs> knock, knock. Off. Hmm? The Oof, are weird. Not a very handsome fellow, is he? We don't have all day here, Reese.
<clears throat> Hi. Excuse me, uh, sir, do you know where the uh, World of Curiosities is? Uh... It should be around here. You lost. Um, Maybe he should have stayed in the what car. What are you here for? He has a suitcase on him. It's just a simple business deal. A few papers to sign, and then we're out. Easy. None of this uh, is what I would actually those say. Those the papers? Of a sort? I'm pulling out my seat. You're Hyperion. You egg suckers ruined this town, you know that? Dude, maybe she Atlas were car. bastards, but at least they had the good sense to fail. When Jack came in, he turned everything to smoke. Listen, all we want are directions to the world of curiosities. That's it, okay? We get that, and we're gone. Gone, huh? Dude, I think you need to get hey, in the little car. little man. What's in the case? Hey, kitty cat. Show us what's in the case. Okay, now, look, before we get all this bent... Uh, oh. Is there, like, a convention or something? Oh. Oh, you're done. <laughs> Bandits. You know what we got here? Reese, do the... We got a couple Hyperion warmongers, gentlemen. The bot, the vet, prime it. <sighs> Already? Really? Just <laughs> give, give me the menu. Okay, but don't go bananas. These things ain't cheap. And do you know what we do with warmongers? Do you know what we do? Should we tell them what we do with Hyperion workers? Who is that? Motorbot deployed. Let's go, Motorbot. <laughs> Listen, boys, you're gonna hand over that case, or you're handing over your heads. Your choice. Look, guys, let's talk about this. <laughs> nice shot. Not quiet all of a sudden. <laughs> I love my character. Oh my goodness. so much. <laughs> oh, thank you kindly. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Uh, Motorbot! Go get the car! Stop! <laughs> oh shit.
Stand still and die. Oh, thank you. That was uber freaking lucky. That's all I wanted to know. You could have avoided all of this. Ow! Get your ass Aww. gone! Okay, okay, okay. Loader bot, put the car down. Sure thing. Right on then. Yes! Loaderbot, we need to find you a name. You were definitely staying around for a while. Fatality. Some day, some rats. We're gonna get inside. Uh, well, we could. Whoop. Just tell it to run. I hope he's able to get away. I will name my firstborn Loderbot. I'm actually going to stop this here and pick it back up later. I really hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. Again, I got it from Steam. Definitely check it out. It was a little pricey, but it, it is Steam. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Definitely hit that like and subscribe button down below. And this way you guys will keep a lookout for my videos. All right, until then, guys. Bye.